Yo, what's going on? We got some gear to open up, and it's pretty awesome. Let's just get to the big stuff right away. Um, right now I'm filming on my Galaxy Note 8, but I will be switching to this, the Logitech C922. And I'm really stoked to, to set this up and use it, so you'll be able to see the difference in video quality. This came to $147 Canadian, and I'm also going to be setting it up on a new tripod that I just bought, which is currently holding up my phone right now, so let's switch it out. Alright, so I changed my mind. <laughs> I'm actually going to open this up first. Pretty stoked to open this up. I haven't um, ever owned a, like a sweet webcam like this, so pretty stoked on setting this up. Ooh. It looks like they they put the the plastic protector on with a couple air bubbles. You probably can't see that, but I noticed that right away. But it looks like it's packaged pretty good. I actually did switch it out at Best Buy for another one because the one that I got originally had a couple marks in the box and I just I just decided that I'd switch it out for another one. <clears throat> All right, so it looks like this. All right, this down here. Sorry, I probably can't really see this right now. I'm just gonna try to pull out the the whole contents of the box. Okay, there we go. So the box is empty now. It's got another instruction manual in it. This is the code for um, X Split three month premium license. I wasn't interested in that. This... Okay, there it is. I was just wondering, I was like, I know this comes with a mini tripod and I see that it's underneath the, the camera here. Okay, so this is just kind of wrapped in cardboard. It's actually, there's not much to this. So this just came out, it's basically all in one piece. The, the USB is nicely wrapped up. One thing that I am going to upgrade on this is the length of the cable. I, I believe it's 5 meters. Uh, I, I think that's what it said before. No, sorry, it's not 5 meters. It's like 6 feet. It's not that long. Um, so I'm looking forward to, to seeing if the length is going to be good. Um, I looked at <clears throat> Best Buy and there's like... A cable, I think it's like thirty four ninety nine. It's like a USB two extension, and that is like that was actually a really long cable extension. I forget how long it was. Hmm. So actually, this isn't the longest. Yeah, I think it's like five feet. <clears throat> so I'm gonna have it set up on a tripod, and this will be connected connected to my computer. So that actually doesn't give me a lot of distance away from my computer because I want to be using this to film music videos mostly so if I have this hooked up to my computer which is this is the computer that I'm going to be using to record with I'll have to have um, this connected and then this on a tripod so I'll be able to get it somewhat close I'm not sure if it's, end up, if it's going to end up being too close but actually I could just move the computer back a little bit because I actually have an extension on my music gear so so that'll be good. It might end up working out good, but I'll end up uh, probably upgrading because I can tell right now that this is this is pretty short. But if you just want it for a webcam and you're putting it on top of your computer, then that's pretty sweet. Um, I'm not going to be using it for the background, uh, whatever it is, <laughs> where you like you you can like fix the background. I might end up doing something with it, but you. Um, you can like make it look like it's like a simulated green screen type thing. Probably won't do that, but I I probably actually will just for fun because I did watch videos online and it's like all blotchy, so that might be kind of cool. But the coolest thing about this is well, is that it can connect to a tripod. So this connection on the bottom here feels pretty snug. Ooh, 
Okay, so this all comes out. So that'll, that'll mount right there, the screw for the tripod. So that'll connect in, and then it can also swivel a little bit more. Okay, this piece comes down. And I believe this one can move up as well. It's got some plastic on it. I'm almost positive this also moves up. It looks like I might have to remove some of this stuff. Oh, no, I guess that's it. I, I really don't know what this front flap piece is for. It can move down and, and up. I don't know what that is. But this will connect to the tripod. Then I can position this. Oh, nice. I can tilt this a little bit too, which I'm definitely going to be using that. So yeah, that's uh, awesome. Um, so I'll have to... I think I'm going to have to install something. Should just be pretty good once I connect it. Um, yeah, so... Comes with this little guy. It's actually a lot better than I thought. It uh, feels strong, durable. It um, feels like it's... Um, like, it doesn't feel cheap, so that's good. Hmm, if you can see that, but... Oh, that's actually got a pretty cool uh, ball swivel on it, so... You could uh, set up some different angles and stuff. I'm going to be using a big tripod. Um, I don't know the name of it. I'll reference the, the video where I initially found out about it. It's a really sweet tripod for the money. I spent, like, like, 80 bucks on it. So, let's open that. Alright, so I finally got this thing set up. I um, installed the software, went to the website, and what I'm using to record this video right now is actually the Microsoft Camera app. There's no specific software for recording or taking pictures. This camera just is used through the app that's already on my computer. So I just open that, and then in the top left-hand corner, it allowed me to hit the switch camera button and then I switched over to this guy. Actually, I could probably switch the cameras during recording. <laughs> no, I can't. You can see how garbage my camera that comes with my computer is. This is the the X the, the HP NV X360. This is the webcam that comes with that. And I will switch back to the the Logitech C922. So you can see it looks a lot better than the other one. You can still see like like little grains of it. Um, like I always notice that in cameras. I guess the camera technology just isn't there yet. That's the autofocus at play. Get a zoom in at my guitar here. It's, it's pretty good at autofocusing. Um, camera is now set up. Do a quick little sound test with the guitar here just from using the, the microphone that's on the camera. Let's check it out. <laughs> Let's uh, let's get on to the rest of the video. <laughs> Been waiting to set this thing up, and uh, it's my new tripod, and uh, let's get it opened. Oh yeah, <laughs> I uh, been waiting to open this, and uh, I didn't really have any point in opening it. I really I, I wanted to until I bought this webcam, but. <laughs> I'm not even going to be able to really use this anyways. It's going to be better to set it up on this mini tripod because the the cable length that it comes with the C922, it's not it's not that good. Like, as far as wanting to have it hooked up to your computer and then using a tripod, you're going to need an extension for that. You might be able to get some setup that works, but it's, uh, it's going to be better. Um, with an extension, so it's not going to cost you that much. 
and I think it'll be worth it. Ooh. <clears throat> All right, so this is the new tripod, and I'm really stoked on this. This is actually the first thing that's come out of the new stuff that I've ordered. I've ordered some new headphones and uh, the Boss RC505, which I'll make another video for. But this is my receipt from Amazon. This is the KNF Concept. So this is the tripod. Came to $105.86 Canadian. That's the little slip that Amazon put on. All right, so let's uh, get this open. There's no tape on the front part here. Ooh, sweet. Yeah, I heard this came with a bag. And when I was looking at the description, it didn't confirm. It didn't confirm. Oh, you see the autofocus go there. It didn't confirm that it had a bag, but it obviously does have a bag, and that's all. That's in the box. It's empty. This is the the bag. It actually looks pretty sweet. Focus on there. Really small, uh, compact bag. Um, I'll have to reference the specs on this tripod, but it's actually a really sweet tripod for the price. And it's got a sweet little carrying pouch. It's all, it's uh, 62 inches, so it's actually pretty decent, and uh, especially for me because I'm a taller guy. But having this added benefit of having a taller tripod it's not going to do me any good with this camera um, with a five foot six foot cable so I'm gonna have to upgrade on that it comes with um, <laughs> some throwaway uh, salt don't want to eat that that stuff in there it comes with that extra strap in here it's cool put this aside so we got, <clears throat> got the tripod here. Let's open this up. Let's see, open it up here. Oh yeah. So, oh, nice. It's got a nice little um, protective pouch on here. I guess this is for the, I know you can put like a sandbag on the bottom here to help weigh it down. It has like a, a hook. That'll be on the bottom here. So this was protecting the top. This little bag. So this is the tripod. It actually looks really, really sweet. It um, it's got a nice like gold outline to it, and there's no like big. There's it looks pretty mint. Well, it's brand new. I see a little mark here. But I think that's just, I don't know what that is, but, but yeah, this thing was looking forward to having this set up. So this is actually going to go the other way. Ooh, you can hear that click into place there. The, the feel of this, just from holding it and moving it around, it, it feels like it's like an, like an awesome tripod. KNF Concept. Ooh, it's got um, some clips here on the front. I'll uh, set it down and show you the top part of it here. It's got a built-in level on it. Let's see if I can zoom in. You can see that. So that'll be cool to use. This um, it's the top of the tripod. I'm going to be able to do lots of cool setups with this. Um, yeah like this is just like the feel of it 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 feels it feels legit so i'm really actually stoked to to set this up and use it so for using this with the new webcam i'm gonna need to extend these legs so it's got three extensions on them and they just clip off like this oh let's get full length on that oh <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me that's actually uh, a lot of length. So I'm looking forward to setting this up. I'm not going to be using this full length now. Um, there's tons of other review videos on this um, tripod. I'm just basically setting this up so that I can... Um, actually, what I'll do is I'll just unclip 
the, the first one, and then I can use that as a way to get a good level. What's going on with this? Okay. It's actually all good. I thought something was uh, different, but this is just um, got a holder on it, and the other, uh, the other legs don't. Right, so that's with the top one adjusted. Oh, this one isn't locked in. So lock that one in, lock that one in. You know what? This actually could work pretty... Pr like, I can get a pretty decent setup without having to buy an extension here. Let me see. I'm going to move this over and, and we're going to see um, what it's like with the short cable. All right, filming with my phone again. This is what it looks like set up on the tripod. It actually has a pretty um, decent amount of cable length left still, so I'll be able to, I'll still be able to set this up without buying the the extra cable for now, and that'll be really cool. One really cool feature about this is I'll try to zoom in and see it is I can just undo this part here, and now I can take off the whole camera. Nope, oh, maybe I have to undo it a little bit more. It'll just slide back out there. And this whole piece underneath just screws off. That way you don't have to twist this camera on with the cable. You can just take it off of the, the tripod here, screw it onto the camera, and then position it into place. And just a little Tighten, and you're good to go. Yeah, so there we have it. I'm, I'm pretty happy with this setup. I'm definitely going to upgrade to the longer cable extension. It's definitely worth it for me. I'll be able to get a lot more angles, and I'll be able to have the tripod raised up higher. Um, so there's lots of... Uh, benefits to having that longer cable but with the cable the way that it's at now and my new tripod set up with these top legs out it's it's still pretty decent like and I can still rotate this around and it's, it's all good so yeah I'm pretty stoked on that so um, if you made it to the end, uh, stay tuned, I'm gonna record a new song with this new setup that I have, and what I will be incorporating into the song is this new music gear that I got. Yeah, check this out. A little a bit of a tambourine action. And I also got these sweet shakers. like four bucks 395 so I'm pretty stoked on that oh and I also got a sock for my mic so be able to put that on and have a little bit of protection on that and that being said this is the end of the video <laughs> so if you want to click on the random links that are showing up anywhere I'm going to record a song so if you want to listen to that you can, uh, oh, wait a minute, what am I doing? I thought I was filming with the other camera, but I wasn't. <laughs> this is the end of the video. See ya.